Hello, hello. It's me, George Michael Welt. I want to share with you what I title The Pursuit of Destiny. How to get to your destiny. There is a way that leads to destiny. I want to share three things with you on how to fulfill your destiny on how to become what God wants you to be. Number one, run with purpose. Run with purpose. Where purpose is not known, waste of time, energy, and resources are inevitable. Where purpose is not known, waste of time, waste of energy, waste of resources are inevitable. It is better to be crawling in the right direction than to be running in the wrong direction. Speed is not a sign of direction. It is very possible to be running and be running in the wrong direction. Habakkuk chapter 2 verse 2. And the Lord answered me and said, Write the vision and make it plain upon tables that he may run that readed it. So, purpose gives direction. Purpose guides energy and resources from wasting away. Number two, how to fulfill destiny? Run in the will of God. Run in the will of God. It is possible to run with purpose outside the will of God. When you are running in the will of God, you are not time conscious. You are God conscious. When you are God conscious, you want to please God, not man. When you are God conscious, you are not age driven, you are fulfillment driven. A lot of people are looking at their age. I'm 43, I'm 52, I'm 61, I'm 34. Uh, can I ever fulfill destiny? Oh, yes, you can. So long as you are running in the will of God and you are running with purpose. You can only finish when you run in the will of God. Apostle Paul told his successor, young Timothy, in Timothy chapter 4, verse 7, he said, I have fought a good fight. I have finished my course. I have kept the faith. So, to finish will require running in the will of God. Finally, number three, how to fulfill destiny? Run with patience. Run with patience. If you are not patient, you cannot go far with God. David said in Psalm 40 verse 1, I waited patiently for the Lord and he heard my cry. I waited patiently. If you want to fulfill destiny, you have to be patient. You have to have a sense of waiting on the Lord. Hebrew chapter 12 verse 1 tells us to run with patience the race that is set before us. There is a race that is set before you and me 
and that race is the race of destiny the race to fulfill that which god has sent you here to fulfill i want to entreat you to run with purpose run in the will of god and run with patience god bless you